What's going on, y'all? Just got back off for it. FRC is steady, chilling. Hold on, I'll be right back. Um, I think the hottest it was today was like uh, 25 was the highest it got to. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I don't switch this hotel twice, this room twice, right? So the first time we were only supposed to be here for one freaking day or one day. So that would have been, I think it was like Saturday or Friday, right? It would have, it was Saturday. They put me 116. I remember that because that's the room, right? This was the same room. We were here for two days. Then we were like, oh, we're going to be down today at 9 o'clock. All right, all right, so boom. We checked out yesterday. Stuff in the truck. Guess what happened? We came back and they put me 115, which is like right across the, right across the, the, the hallway. And then guess what? We were gonna be done today. The prediction was we were gonna be done by two o'clock, and then head to New, head into New Mexico. Are you with me? Head into, are you with me, you two? <clears throat> Obviously, I'm back in the hotel room, so we didn't get done. Have you ever just had like a life experience to where? encourages you to do things my co-worker man i'm tired of his face now that's the best i'm gonna say about it man i want this project to be over with i'm tired of spending 18 30 dollars for a burger i'm tired of re looking at homes that are 20 30 million dollars it makes no sense this, the scenery is gorgeous, it's beautiful, but I'm tired of it. But most importantly, I'm tired of looking at this man's face. I'm tired, bro. Like, let's hot speed this up <clears throat> and move on. At least let's bring somebody else around us. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, I'm, I'm... Question is, how many people does it take to put on a manifold? We've been trying to put on a manifold for three days now, y'all. Some of you who don't know what it is, allow me to use my, um, my, uh, what, what you call this? Anyways. My little oil that I burn out here to sleep good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I carry, I have this one every day. Every room I go to, the first thing I do is set it up. So it can start bringing that beautiful aroma to the room. <clears throat> I'm going to show you what a manifold freaking look like, all right? It's supposed to look like this, all right? Hear me out. This is coming from a, a trucker now that came to this part of work to learn some stuff, right? I ain't been doing this since I'm serving you so like everybody else, especially certain individuals. They've been doing this as soon as they came out of the JJ, okay? That's what I was told. Now, we did a whole bunch of nonsense out here, the ditches and all that, all that, all that, all that for like eight days. Hey, this is inside the house. This is actually will be more like in the basement, okay? This one. Because each manifold has three insoles, right? So we we got two. It's supposed to be like this. One, two, three, one, two, three. Bro. Somebody originally created a manifold ahead of time. They didn't fit. The last two days, just to get these to insert like this underneath the house have taken us three freaking days <laughs> because somebody's out here doing eye test measurement right i'm out here look how many people does it take to put on a manifold right 
apparently one and yours truly being the helper. I'm looking, we have a, me look, measure tape right here. Manifold right here. Measure tape, my, people just out here eye testing. There's no freaking measurement, then we, then we overshoot the man either something is too long something is too small something no bro it been three freaking days i'm tired of looking at this man time to go home time well not to go home but time to get around other people because right now just us two us two it's a freaking manifold bro this thing if you know what you're doing like you're telling everybody bro three of these you boom boom that's it with air pressure, make sure the person just spending 20, 25 million dollars on this damn house, make sure they can get some damn AC and some heater in this house. 30 minutes work, boom, boom, has turned into three freaking days, man. Three days. At this point, man, at, at this point, I, I might go back to trucking, y'all, because I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you, man. Because the part where the manifold goes, the part with the hookup that was supposed to put a manifold on, is almost like a basement, but it's actually where all the power stuff gonna go, you know, like the, the backup generator for that, you know, whatever rich people do, all the things to have a heated driveway, you know, nonsense like that, right? They chose to build in an area with snows, but they wanna heat their driveway. That's how you know you got too much damn money, but it don't matter. So that's the area we're in right now. It's why all the power, the water, purify this, purify that, this and that, what, 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 what all that going to go there. We could not fit a freaking manifold. We could not. A map. Actually, I can't even say we, because uh, I'm doing the grunt work on this one. I was sitting down here, it was supposed to be a three-day project, but hey, Hamilton go down there help him finish that job and then come back to New Mexico, which is where I would been working the last month or so. Boy, boy, I got here. The 29th, I swear today's like the 10th, the 12th. I've been here too damn, all we talk. Long story short, it takes one person to freaking handle men a manifold, but apparently it takes three, four, five freaking days to make one correctly. And you've been doing this since you came out of your mama's JJ based on what you told me. So somebody lying on the side. Somebody lying. Somebody's lying. It's either this alleged co-worker does not know what the hell he's doing. Or he's just starting because I'm a newbie. Somebody lying. Even my dumb ass, new to the business, could have fit this. Right here, boom, into a freaking three PVC pipes and call it a day and air pressure that, bro. It's been three days. We 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 are here cutting, slicing, taking off, splitting. Three days later, <clears throat> we finally pressurize the manifold today. So what it is, like I said, <clears throat> we got the whole long ass ditch so we got a air pressure there the compressor took like three hours and guess what there was a leak oh my god so now we're gonna so now we're gonna have to go back tomorrow to work on the same damn manifold we'll be working on th look the migos could have done this in 20 minutes I could have done it in two hours because I'm dumb and I don't know nothing mechanically, but just all it takes is you measure with a tape, bro. You put a three inch or two inch. <clears throat> That's it. That's it. You can put a reducer on it. Or, <clears throat> or a three inch 90 at the end like this. And you put the stuff that goes in the middle, boom. So it's supposed to be three inch 90s like this in the middle. Just connect the thing, man. It's taking us three days. I can't say nothing, though. Because I'm the newbie out here. I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing. What I do know, though, is we are still getting paid by the hour to take 
to take three, four days to put this on some PVC pipes we already connected and fused. So now tomorrow we're gonna do it again. And then sit there for another two, three hours to air pressure because we gotta put about 10,000 gallons of air pressure into those PVC pipes we have fused together, make sure nothing's gonna leak. So when we make sure whoever is paying 20, 21 million dollars for this house, gotta make sure the AC come in clutch with no problem. Oh yeah, yeah, make sure the water just flowing with no problem. That's what we gotta make sure, that's our job. But somebody out here lying or somebody, I've been doing this job since I was, seven, yeah, yeah, seven my ass. <laughs> Boy, seven my ass, boy. Oh man, this man out here got me getting paid. Getting paid three days to do the same damn thing over and over. See, that's that good old boy relations right there, because that was me. I got a feeling it, <sighs> something, man, but, but hey, that's that good old boy relations. I'm just out here doing the runaway slave work, aka the grunt work on this one, okay? When he said jump, I said how high, that's it, that's what I'm getting paid for. Getting paid for, but somebody is lying. Somebody is lying about knowing how to do what they say they know how to do. That's all I'm saying, you two. If this, I'm so tired looking at this man's face. If this continue, y'all, I've been trucking next week.